vloggy vlogsters welcome to another pandemic times lockdown two weekly vlog um i should be on holiday this week with my husband for his birthday we should be by the sea we should be waking up having some lovely breakfast seeing the seaside um instead as you can see from my face and the light that's reflecting on it um it's very gray outside and i'm gonna clean the flat because quite frankly it's just horrendous it's just 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 horrendous Wesley's still just gonna relax and why not this is Wesley right hello flat looking generally much tidier much more spick and span after yesterday and today I'm having one of those like annoying jobs I have put off forever type days these horrendously muddy boots rewax them Maybe catch up on a bit of Outlander on my laptop whilst I do. Not perfect, but definitely look a lot better. Next up, the coffee and tea shelf. The baking shelf is tidy. The coffee shelf is tidy. Even the Tupperware drawer is tidy. I'm really sorry if the tumble dryer is very loud, but I've also done some washing high washing pans and fixed some wonky pictures that have been really annoying me for ages. Yay! I think that's me. Me done. Wednesday, uh, Dan is now officially off work as well because of course we were meant to be on holiday for his birthday. Uh, we are not. Um, he has just gone to go and pick up the shopping because Joyce of lockdown we can get a couldn't get a delivery slot, so we've done a to get a click and collect. So that's why he's gone to pick that up. And whilst he's doing that, I am gonna vacuum and have a little dust and clean in the office because I couldn't do that earlier in the week because he was working in there. So fun times, fun times all around. <laughs> oh, and uh, yeah, I got the running gear on because hoping that'll persuade me that I'm going to go for a run. pink of cheek and damp of hair because we've just been for a little drizzly walk but they've put the Christmas lights up in the jewellery quarter which is lovely um I can't really think what I have said or not said to you this week I had Dan's birthday which was very very chill um just went for a really long walk to Edgebuston Reservoir which we hadn't done yet even though we've been living in Birmingham like nearly a decade. It's really nice. We definitely left it a little bit late because it started to get dark by the time we were getting there. So we needed to get back, we'd walk all the way around. So it literally was to and from. Wesley was very into the sniffs. So it took us quite a while <laughs> to get there and back, but we went up and down the canal, very good. Um, had Dishoom takeaway for dinner. And oh my God, 
so good I feel like the only person in Birmingham who hasn't been to Dishoom I know that is not true <laughs> but still because we haven't been like going to places um even when like restrictions had eased uh, we haven't been and they started doing takeaway on delivery um, and it wasn't cheap as well like it's not just an everyday meal it was a, a special treaty meal um and they were really good with my allergies as well like i basically emailed them and they just sent me a list of stuff that was safe for me to eat and it all arrived beautifully packaged and like with instructions of like how to put it all together so like the sauce was separate so like the batter on the chicken didn't go soggy and you know things like that just very very nice so we did that Another very relaxed day yesterday. I can't even think what we did, to be honest. <laughs> um, and then uh, today I have just made the Christmas cake. We've measured up for curtains in here. Again, something we've still not done, even though we've lived here, God, four years now, five years, four, four and a half years, four and a half years. Um, I've measured all of that so we can order them tomorrow and get them delivered. Uh, Dan's making ramen. We had some leftovers from when he did ramen a few weeks ago in the freezer so it seems like a good day for ramen it's very very rainy very very chilly and damp and that's it really and then sunday i mean we'd really like to go out for a walk a long one but i think the weather's going to be pants again but we'll see what it's like tomorrow i've popped what uh should hopefully be jamie oliver's beef ragu tomorrow in the slow cooker so i can do overnight good morning ragu oh it smell good. Hi, Hi, <laughs> Yay! <laughs> this ragu has been cooking since yesterday and it smells amazing. 